what do you think? What are private sources? What could be private so fundraising from private sources, which are not governmental sources? What do you think? Hmm? Companies. I'm sorry. Yes, companies. Churches. Hmm? Private persons. What else? Pardon me? Charity organizations. We have foundations, right? Crowdfunding. The membership fee is a way also to have money. I don't know if we are going to put it in the private resources or in the association resources. Membership. Yeah, fee. Sometimes membership fee. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Or participation fee to an event too. Sometimes you can collect some a good money from that. Fees. Okay. Yeah. Events, events. Yes. Yes. Lottery, oh. <laughs> cool. Yeah. Um, I think that's another way of um, getting fun is what we call pitching. Pitching, okay. Pitching. Never heard. You don't. You don't no? Pitch. no. That is, you are giving a um, few minutes to present and sell yourself. Oh. Ah, it's an American, okay. It's an American way of um, raising funds also. Pigeon. Pigeon. I will mention also um, self-financing because uh, <coughs> like uh, uh, in my organization, yeah. um, we are dealing, we are working with people uh, we, who um, uh, say we are engaged for this uh, objective and we finance this also. Uh, it's, it's like um, so dona Small donation, but not, uh, not a donation, like uh, if I have a project Mm -hmm. And I don't have uh, official uh, financing, yes. so I will manage to, fa fa to fa finance it uh, myself. Do you give money to yes. the project or do you work for the project without gaining money? You, you give money you without give money. gaining yeah. money. Yeah. I don't know how to call it. Uh, Self-financing. A workshop. A workshop. Workshops, yeah. How like do you uh, uh, in Croatia, we try to, uh, to make some events when we make Af African beats, then okay. after this we, yes. okay. we try to sell. So, um, raise fun. selling services, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> um, I also think that maybe it's like it's not monetary, but it's also uh, a huge important factor. It's like human resources when you have like a huge. Um, pool of volunteer workers, you can save a lot of money. Ateliers. Volunteers. Um, I call that donations in kind, right? It's this um, donation in kind. And I write here volunteer. Donations in kind are, uh, if you need something, uh, let, let's say a service, let's say you need a new homepage for your organization. Now you have two possibilities. The one possibility is you go and search somebody who and pay him to do it. The other possibility is to ask him to do it for free. And then he, this was a donation of kind from him to your organization and it's worth money. Sorry. <laughs> Yeah, uh, sorry. 
Another way is having a, pro a project that is self-sustainable. Uh, like for me, uh, we have a project where we empower the young women to make hand-dyed scarves, which I have yes. here. Mm -hmm. uh, I have them. You will look at them and buy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so whatever, they are in different uh, patterns. This is one. Eh? So whatever sales that we actually make out of these scarves goes back to the project and the women to enable them earn a stipend that can actually sustain them. Mm -hmm. So that way you find donors ask that uh, at the end of our funding, uh, how are you going to sustain this project or uh, the other programs? Okay. Yeah. Good. We, we call that merchandising. It's quite a list until now. You still keep going. Yeah. That's what you call naklas in Germany. Naklas. Naklas. Yeah, so uh, naklas. Yeah. Nachlass. Yeah. Nachlass. Yes, yeah. yes, legacies. Mm -hmm. yeah, legacy. Exactly. Yeah. Somebody dies and he wants to, to continue to support you with your money, even after, with his money, even after death. Then he, he, he um, leaves a legacy, a, a, a Nachlass, a legacy. We have also one, uh, I don't know whether it's everywhere, one system in Switzerland where we have uh, two um, big, very, uh, very big banks, um, Credit yes. Suisse and um, yes. UBS. Mm -hmm. um, sometimes when you're doing an activity and you go to them, they don't give you money in cash. Yes. But they will allow you to use their name on your, as logo in your distance. Mm -hmm. And that helps other companies to come along to say, oh, UBS is there, so I'm yes. also coming there. A sponsorship. There are two different kinds of sponsors. We write here sponsors from companies. I'm saying sometimes I have a project, I don't have enough money, I still need the money, I can do a partnership with another organization, we have maybe the similar goal. Yeah. And so that we can, you know, you can I can say that we mobilize money from that side too. Mm -hmm. yeah, okay, you is. can access the database of the other organization, the other organization accesses your database and together you can... Exactly. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, I think lately social media is one way of fundraising through Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, mm -hmm. and even uh, yearly reports. Mm -hmm. Yes. So <laughs> social media, <laughs> yes, of course. I put that to, um, uh, close to crowdfunding. Now, only to, to think about wording, um, using social media, then social media is a channel through which you can do crowdfunding, as well as printed media, TV, radio, whatever. Mm -hmm. uh, I have just written, we have raised zero in our organization, but what I know is uh, by creating uh, shocking events and uh, uh, the timing, because most organization, what you need is you send uh, an African kid to uh, home to, to, to people by post and your address, then they get money. By, yeah. So yesterday we have been, uh, do you get me? Using images, yeah. shocking events, for example, Migration today is a very big yes. issue. Yes. You can use it whether you work in, on migration or not. Yeah. Yes. Uh, this is the other one is just people send images. Yes. To people to their house, and then they get the ethical aspect is uh, another thing. But they do uh, that kind. Yesterday we sent a, a complaint about this uh, organization going home collecting like this uh, fundraising, and they collect money physical money around the, the, the house of people, yeah. So how do you see it? Is this one, is it a... Is it, um, let's say, direct mailing? When you mail somebody yeah. and, and you ask him to, to pay money, you send him a letter or a picture or whatever? I believe he is talking about emotional marketing. Ah. He's okay. referring to emotional okay. marketing, how okay. certain images are being distorted and mm -hmm. used 
to gain money. Okay. That's what he's referring to. So let's say that there are um, ethical aspects in fundraising. They're very important to look after. Last point. I think... Uh, wow, it's even uh, nine minutes late. Sorry, I want to... Last point? Wanna, yes. Are you okay with one I, last point? I would like to add uh, a, a credit to... Credit? Uh? Yes, to found. You know, sometimes you can organize the event, you can take a credit for somebody. Credits. Mm -hmm. And then... Okay. Uh, you, you need to make sure that the people will pay the cotization or the fee to attend it. Yeah, and they okay. can refund. 